So today uh, we are finishing up day three of a three-day training with new fire gear, with the new recruit class that is in uh, class 110. And I'm just down here on my day off to help with the training academy to teach PPE, uh, personal protective equipment, to the new recruits. What makes this gear uh, special is this is the first gear that we've purchased that we've designed some extra protection in it from particulates that are in smoke that are the cancer causing agents uh, when they get against our skin. It's very, very similar to the regular gear we have. The gear has three main functions. One is uh, to keep the thermal effects of fire away from our body and our skin, keep us from getting burned. There's a vapor barrier in there that keeps water from being absorbed through and touching our skin, which could cause us to be uh, steamed in hot fire. And then the outer shell, which protects us from abrasion cuts and that kind of thing. Nice thing about this is it's got kind of a snow skirt type thing around the waist, which keeps smoke from coming up through the bottom of the coat. It has different material in the wristlets, which keeps the smoke from coming up our sleeves. Then we have the same thing around the ankles, which keeps it from coming up the cuffs of our pants up to our legs. We need, we need to be able to protect ourselves as well as uh, get to you quickly. So we want to make sure that they can put this personal protective equipment on quickly to be able to be protected so they can come and take care of the citizens of Columbus. Our goal for the recruits is to be confident in their gear, to be able to put it on as a muscle memory afterthought and not even think about it so that we're prepared to take care of the people that are counting on us instead of not being prepared ourselves and then we have to watch out for each other. Hopefully this gear will prevent firefighters from getting cancer at the rate that we're currently getting it.